Yo, what's going on guys, man, and welcome to Modern Warfare 2019. I don't know why, but today I randomly had the itch to revisit this game. And look, I still have Dark Matter from Cold War. Ah, uh, I've even still got Atomic on my M4, what? Why was this glitch one of the best things to ever happen to this game? Just look at how beautiful Dark Matter looks in this game. It's almost like it was supposed to be a thing. That's suspicious. I do still hate myself for never unlocking Dark Ether from Cold War Zombie. 5,000 likes. <laughs> Today, I wanted to see how this game is holding up in 2024. I have heard that this game is full of hackers now. So we're also going to be playing Search and Destroy later in this video because apparently that's where most of them are. No way we just got shipment. No way. Oh my God. By the way, thank you for all of the support you guys have been showing on the channel lately. If you are new around here, please subscribe. Oh, bro, I forgot about this. And we've got Dark Matter on the MP5. Oh, this is too iconic. Is it just me that thinks this game just looks looks beautiful. Why does it look so nice in comparison to the recent cards? I don't get it. Fire shotgun, bro. We're using a fire. The doof doof. Ain't no way. There's just something about this game that is just so appealing to look at. I don't know what it is, but it just looks way... Oh, you can climb on the containers in this game, but look at it. Just look how it blurs the background when you inspect your weapon. It's just so perfect. Bro, put that away, man. Boom! <laughs> this game is just too iconic for me, man. I don't know what it is. And the chances of us getting shipment to play on is just crazy. Car 98. Oh, Red Dot 2? We've got to get a kill with this. Woo! Come on! Oh boy. So the crazy part is, you guys have to remember, this game didn't come out last year, not the year before. It came out in 2019. It's damn near five years ago now. Damn. Well, not quite, but you know what I mean. How does this still look this good to us? We got the win, but that guy with the doof doof was so annoying. Wait, that's a... Yo! <laughs> they just gave us a 360 of the dance. We got Scrapyard, so it's definitely time to bust out the Atomic M4. Come on now. I also love the bold markers on the minimap. I think it's the thick outline that it has. Why do they not do that anymore? It just looks so much better in my opinion. Yo, what are we doing, guys? Yo, what are we doing? Can we get out of here? It's years later. Can we just have some fun? It's so crazy because up to now, we've... Oh my, bro, what the... Up to now, we've played two maps that we've already got in Modern Warfare 3. <laughs> oh! See, I know how to play this map. It's funny because when I recorded earlier, I was playing a bunch of random maps that I had never played before. Are you staring at the door? So I was... Oh my. So I was completely clueless. Let's just say that. I'm one off my advanced UAV and I just want to see how... Oh, that's a teammate. I panicked. I just want to see how it looks on the minimap. Don't lead them to me, bro. Get out of my court. Move. All of my teammates are around me now. Lighting up the area. Bro. Okay. Um, I don't know why we're putting claymores down. So yesterday I saw on Twitter that Call of Duty 2027. <laughs> I know it sounds crazy, but the developers have been confirmed for that game and it is Sledgehammer, which I don't know why that is relevant information at all. But yeah, 2027 is being made by Sledgehammer. Great. <laughs> nice. A lot of people were talking about it though. Some people were quite unhappy. And to that, I don't understand why. Oh my goodness. I guess people have lost hope in Sledgehammer ever since they dropped World War II and Vanguard. Yeah, those didn't make any sense at all. But Modern Warfare 3 is pretty good, right? And they made that. By the way, talking about Modern... Oh, bro, it's the same flipping guy that's ruined my streak again. Oh, this game just looks so beautiful, man. Talking about Modern Warfare 3, it's made this game, believe it or not, feel kind of sluggish. Huh? We had Modern Warfare 2 last year, and that game, oh, man, the movement on that game was dreadful. So when you would come back to Modern Warfare 2019 after that game, you'd be like, oh, my goodness. The movement would feel so buttery. But now it's made me realize how fast Modern Warfare 3's movement is. Oh my goodness. There we go. Enemy 
Come on. Reload! What's that? Rally LMG? What is this? I forgot about this one. Bro, this one guy with the Uzi has ruined my entire game. Wait, why is there three gamer cities in huh? one lobby? What is that? Where's 43? Azir Cave to Baraka Urzikstan? <laughs> Wait, hold up a second. Am I the only one realizing that we had Urzikstan right in front of us this entire time? Isn't Urzikstan the new Warzone map or am I being stupid? Can I see it? No, I, I don't see it. Time to bust out the Dark Matter Car 98K. Oh, man. So, yeah, we have Sledgehammer in 2027. We don't care about that. What I do care about, though, is the fact that we have a Treyarch game this year. It's been leaked that it's Gulf War, and I was kind of scared about that because Gulf War, I believe, is set in 1991, so that's of course in the past not too far in the past but it's a good 30 years how does this guy just know where i what the you see that reticle that's one thing that i miss from this game too being able to unlock reticles the blue dot even this site on the car 98 it was just worth unlocking stuff like this i don't know why they would ever take stuff like that away anyway as i was saying i was upset about it being gulf war until i thought about call of duty black ops cold war and cold war was also set in the past however correct me if i'm wrong and let me know if it's just me but i do not feel like cold war feels like a call of duty set in the past they did a good job of making that game feel modern it had the movement it had the camos it had the bundles i would not have guessed that was cold war and that was set even further in the past than gulf war is about to be if it is gulf war and if that is the truth <laughs> but knowing that that makes me a little bit more comfortable man get out of that window oh my wait see this guy there we go Where are you oh i always hated this map Oh, that was a great shot. A hit marker. Oh, of course, his doesn't get a hit marker, but mine does. One thing I will mention is we haven't run into a hacker yet, which is kind of surprising. Woo. A lot of you guys have been asking me to revisit these old Call of Duties once again since it is the new year. It's like a trend that we all do. Every single year, we always run back the old Call of Duties, and I love it, honestly. Come on, brother. Really? Really? So let me know what other Call of Duty's you want me to revisit. Of course, I know you guys want the Black Ops 4 series back. Actually, now that I think about it, I think this game looks so good to me because when I was playing this game or when most of us were playing this game, we were all on console. But now I'm on PC with 1440p and everything just looks like crazy to me. Hey, what's your fire? No. Sorry, buddy. You're not getting my teammate. Oh no, what? Damn. Oh, yo, what sort of lobby is this? Again, like I said, we haven't run into any hackers yet. And now we're in search and destroy, which is where apparently most of them are. Oh. Damn, oh, he's hitting the silent shots. This guy knows what he's doing. Okay, I see you. Dad, yeah. Wait, what? Hey, <laughs> get out of here. Oh, wait. Are you flipping serious? Yo! The Ironside Dark Matter AMAX. Wow. You can tell these guys are on mouse and keyboard just by the way they're moving their aim. Oh, he's chasing him. Oh! <laughs> wait, what? Wait, this guy's level 15. I don't know. One thing about me is I did not play Search and Destroy on this game, so I do not know where I'm supposed to go. Don't get me wrong, this game was great and all, but it kind of went crazy when Warzone came out, let's be honest. Uh, actually, Search and Destroy was really popular in this game too. Ah, hey! Bro, what the flip? The bomb just blew up and made me one shot. Wait, what am I looking at? We're about to play Rust? Something ain't right. Wait, Rust search yeah, and destroy? I didn't know this was a... Wait, someone died that quick. Yo, what? Is he hacking? Yo! Wait, what is this? Is... Nah, 
I'm confused. Hold up. We just joined a rust search and destroy lobby, which is already throwing me off. But this guy's got, I don't know what camo that is. He's not supposed to have that on. And they are all so hacking. You guys should have seen my face when we were loading in. I was already suspicious. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to get a kill. That's our only objective right now. Oh, I got a kill. I don't know if my teammates are hacking as well. I couldn't tell you. I don't know. I'm just trying to hide behind stuff. There's a guy right there. There he is. He's hacking. He was facing the other way. Watch this. Wait, he wasn't? Oh, wait, he was. He was facing the other way. Oh, yeah, great. Yes, yeah, sick. That's great. That man was facing the other way with a riot shield on his back, so there was nothing I could do. That is insane. Great. my teammates are hacking too. Bro, am I the only one not hacking right now? No, this is hackers versus hackers. Riot shield hackers. This is insane. Who's gonna win? They're teasing each other. Oh, oh, they both got one hit. Yo, my eyes hurt. My eyes hurt. He got the execution? How? How did that work? He's got infinite slide. What is this? What is going on? Bro, I genuinely do not understand what's going on. I don't get it. Why is this happening? And why do they all have riot shields? He let him... He got the execution. <laughs> I'm done. What is this? I'm over it. <laughs> we did manage to get a kill though. I will take that. I'm pretty sure everyone but me is a hacker in this lobby. So I clearly just don't stand a chance. <laughs> but what camo is that though? Can someone tell me what camo that is? I've never seen hackers fight with riot shields. That's one thing I've never seen in my life. Typically, you know, aimbot, headshot across the map, all that type of stuff. Never a riot shield battle. And by the way, someone needs to let me know, is Rust Search and Destroy an actual thing? Or did I just find a hacker lobby completely? Did they somehow hack Rust into Search and Destroy? I don't know. They are not letting me live. There is no way. Let me sit behind his riot shield. Come on, bro. Why can I not be part of the foot? Yo, bro, this is insane. <laughs> okay, so I understand this lobby now. It's a 1v1 finishing move lobby. So the whole goal is to finishing move the other person. If they melee them, then they're kind of cheating. And he lost. <laughs> GG. Bro said GG's in the chat for that. That's hilarious. Let me join in. GG. <laughs> And after that, that's definitely enough of this game for me. I think I've come to the conclusion that this game is pretty much ruined. All people really played this game for was Search and Destroy. And if you tried to search for Search and Destroy matches now, there's a good chance you'll get into lobbies like that with aimbot, infinite slides, riot shield 1v1s. I don't know. I'm sure there's even more too. I've seen some crazy stuff. But be sure to let me know in the comments what other Call of Duties you want me to revisit. I think I'm going to do a run through a bunch of them because we're kind of in between seasons right now we're on the way to season two so we're at the part where we're a little bit bored of modern warfare 3 waiting for some new content so i'm revisiting some old cards but yeah man thanks for watching i'll see you guys in the next one